Yo, what is going on guys? RB Plays here back again with another YouTube video for you guys. And now as you guys can probably tell by the title of this video, I'll be showcasing the best slash most overpowered 600k team after the kind of update and market crashes that has been happening in Foot 18 Ultimate Team. So if you guys are here to obviously check the team out, which is why you probably clicked on the video anyways, then please drop a like if you do end up enjoying it and also subscribe if you're new, on, uh, new around here and also turn on post notifications because sometimes even if you are subscribed, you don't get notified when I do upload. So uh, yeah, just letting you guys know. But yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy this video and without further ado, let's get straight into it. <music> So as you guys can see, we are using the 4-3-2-1 forward formation, the left uh, the left forward, right forward formation. This formation is one of the best formations in this game, in my opinion. This, along with a few other formation, this formation, this formation does really work well. So I hope you guys do end up enjoying uh, this formation and, of course, the team. But anyways, into the first place, straight ahead we go. We do have the PSG man himself, Kylian Mbappé. Yes, that's right, guys. Kylian Mbappé leads the front line, leads that strike force in the striker position. Absolute beast of a player. I'm pretty sure... Um, all of you guys do already know how sick this guy is and now on to the left forward position We have in my opinion the best player or maybe the second best player in the world. We have the your boy Neymar Zito. Yes, that's right guys Neymar Zito is an absolute beast in this game. I absolutely love him I've used him so much in this game and I just think he's so so sick his agility his dribbling stats are just amazing And then along with his pace and shooting it's just like it's just incredible and yes I know he's not one of the strongest people in this game but still his dribbling abilities are just amazing so obviously he can get out very uh, tight and close situations in this game and now on to the right forward position to complete this amazing strike force we do have an inform who goes by the name of Romain Alessandrini yes that's right inform Alessandrini at the start of FIFA like mm, how can I put it? Um, near around the start of FIFA, this guy was getting used a lot. But as FIFA's kind of gone on, I've noticed that people stopped using him as much. And I don't know why, because this guy is an absolute beast. Like, everyone, like, his inform card is just amazing. Just have a look at those stats, guys. Just please have a look. Four star, uh, four star skill is four star weak foot, left footed. And then his sprint speed is sick. He's got 75 physical. His strength is decent. He's got amazing dribbling. Passing is okay and his shooting and acceleration slash pace are just amazing. I really do think this guy is very good in this game. And I think that if you were to switch formation and you play him cam, he's also really, really good at cam. I love him at cam. Or maybe even center mid, he's just amazing. He's really kind of like an all-round player apart from defending. He can do pretty much most things in this game. So I really do recommend you go ahead and buy Romain Alessandro because he is really a beast in this game. I'm telling you guys, an absolute beast. But anyways, yeah, as you can see in right in front of your screens, this is the strike force of the team. And I, I'm just telling you, this team is an absolute beast. An absolute beast of a strike force. But anyways, onto the center mid we go. We have the anchor, well, no, nah, he's not really the anchor. This guy's an all round player in this team. We have another inform who goes by the name of Wylan Whelan Cipriani. Cipriani, oh, this guy is so, so amazing. I just, I was just searching, hmm, what players? What players can I try out that are French? That's different from Bakioko. And then I come along this guy, Cyprian. Oh my days, I had to try him out. I had to try out this card. And may I just say, this guy is just astonishing. An absolute beast. He can do everything you need him to do on the pitch, I'm telling you. And that is why he's just going to be our all-round centre mid. Um, I would recommend in-game... Well, once I once I complete this uh, midfield, I'm gonna change you to. I'm gonna um, tell you guys to rotate the players around because I don't I don't want Cyprian um, being central centre mid just because of the player that uh, the next player that I'm about to show you. And I think they should swap positions. But yeah, I'll get onto that now. In the left centre mid position, we do have your boy Casemiro, and yes, that's why I was trying to say that. That's why I want I want um, Casemiro to be in the central centre mid position because he is more defensive minded. He is more of a defensive midfield than Cyprian. Cyprian is our mid. Uh, an all-round midfielder who will go and who, who will go up and attack more. That's why Casemiro has to be in the anchor position. But when you go in game, you pause it and put him in there so no chemistry is affected. All right, guys. But anyways, onto the right centre mid. We do have another League One beast, another League One in form. 
we do have the man who is in the thumbnail, the 87 rated, I believe. Is he 87 rated in form? Yes, he is. 87 rated in form for Kier. And just have a look at that card. This card is a card everyone needs to try out. I don't see him enough. Um, used enough in this game and I really really do think he should be used more because this guy is an absolute beast he is so overpowered he is so sick in this game as you can see his shooting stats are amazing his dribbling stats are amazing his passing stats his strength like he's just got everything he's fast he's strong he can shoot he can pass he can dribble the only thing he can't do is just defend but he's a cam he can play set I'm telling you you really you really need to use this guy okay you really 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 do need to use this guy because he's an absolute beast and he just doesn't get used enough in this game but anyways on to the right back we do have another league one player but um this right back he there's nothing special about him i'm just gonna be honest with you guys i'm not gonna lie to you if i don't think a player is that amazing then i'm not gonna obviously lie to you and say oh yeah they're the best player in the game they're the best right back blah 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 no this guy i'll just be honest with you guys he just gets the job done nothing more nothing less he's just a basic right back that's just filling in for the team because i mean i can't really get anyone uh, anyone else better than him so i thought you know why not just go ahead and get him and I accidentally backed out and now I can't find him there we go there's a the squad but yeah just a standard right back just as he just gets the job done really that's all I have to say about him but the left back we do have here from the Liga this guy is an absolute beast and this guy gets more than the job done this guy Marcelo oh my days he can attack as well and he can defend this guy is one of the best left backs in this game in my opinion I really really do recommend you go ahead and pick up your boy Marcelo because this guy is sick and I'm pretty sure everyone knows how sick he is I mean a and I exclusion all the pro players use him a lot of people do use Marcelo and this guy is amazing in this game and now I wanted to okay, just show you guys this center back this center back here is a center back I really 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 wanted to um what's it called show you guys and he does in fact have the same name which I don't this guy literally has the same name I don't understand why um, this Marcelo is coming up because uh, maybe it's a different one I don't know but he is a league one centre back it is another inform and he has the same name he's Marcelo as well um, his inform is 85 rated I'm not sure I think his normal card must be this then yeah it is yeah 79 rated is normal card but we're going for his 85 rated inform yes 72 pace is quite decent but 87 defending an 89 physical it's just immense. It's absolutely sick. And there you go. 76 sprint speed. And his shot power is really high. Jeez. Yeah, but yeah, look at that. 97 strength. This guy almost has 100 strength. This guy is not getting denched out. He will be denching out everyone on the pitch. I'm telling you guys. You really go and need to head and pick up this guy. Because his strength is just immense and amazing. I'm telling you. An absolute beast, an absolute beast of a card. I really do recommend you go ahead and snatch him up. I'm not sure how much he is. But I can quickly check for you right now if you just want to do go ahead and snatch him up he is 56k on ps4 and 47k on xbox one so i really do suggest you go ahead and pick him up but anyways we do have another psg player to partner up with marcelo in the name of tiago silva and yes i this is another guy he is very high rated in this game but for some reason just no one runs him in this game it's just pretty it's just pretty simple no one literally runs him in this game and i also do recommend you put shadows on these two center backs just to give them an extra boost of pace as well as um, in fact not even the two center backs just everyone um the whole back line you want to put a shadow on and then the um on uh, Fakir, you want to put like a hunter slash hawk on Cyprian and, and Casemiro, I'd recommend a shadow. And uh, these three, of course, you want to put a hunter. Just a little tip for you guys: chemistry stars are really important in FIFA 18 Ultimate Team. Really, they really do. Um, they are game changers. I'm telling you guys. But anyway, to complete the team, we do have the Brazilian keeper that plays for Manchester City. His name is Ederson. Just pretty simple. This guy's low rated, but some reason in this game, he's an absolute god. He's so so sick. I, in the Premier, I usually only use um, him or Czech, but obviously Czech won't give Kem. So I've gone with Edison, and Edison is just a beast. I'm telling you, those stats are a lie. They should be much higher than what they actually are. But anyways, guys, this is a team. But I'm not done here because I want to quickly give you guys an alternative, um, a different formation to use, which I really do recommend. Last video, I've done a 4-3-1-2, but this one, we're going to be doing the 4-1-2-1-2 narrow. I really do recommend this formation. This formation is amazing. Um, if I can quickly find it. And also the player instructions to use. Let me quickly just rearrange the team for you guys. And this is how you want to structure the team when you do. If you are, um, if you do want to change formation. And if you do want to play with this formation. This is how you're going to change it. 
just put Fakir left center mid there. You're gonna keep it like this, structured like this. And then what you would, uh, what you want to go ahead and do is uh, press triangle, go into player instructions. And then these are the player instructions you want to use. You want to use just getting behind on Mbappe, and that's it. Balance runs, it's just balance whip, and then getting behind for Neymar Rizito as well. And then just stay forward for your cam. And then now here's where the juicy stuff comes. All you want to do is just go on aggressive interceptions, interceptions for Cyprian. And that goes for the same as for Kier. Just aggressive interceptions, balance attack. And then Casemiro goes stay back while attacking along with aggressive interceptions. And then on your full backs, all you put is stay back while attacking. And there you go, guys. There are the player instructions for this team. I really do hope you guys did enjoy this video. So if you did, please go ahead and smash the like button. And also, like I said at the beginning of the video, if you're new around here, don't forget to subscribe. Turn on post notifications if you did enjoy this video. And uh, yeah, I really do hope you did enjoy it. And I'll see you in the next one. It's be your boy, RRB Plays. And I'm out. See ya. Boom, boom. Oh my God, oh my God. If I die, I'm a legend. When they lay me down to rest, I know I was always repping. Oh my God, my whole life, my words been my greatest weapon. I know I, I know I been the coast's greatest blessing. Better recognize the